Hello, my lovely Leo. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Leo, today will do your daily read for the 5th and the 6th of November. As you know, loves, this is a general read. Might resonate with you, might not. Take it accordingly and leave what's not. Also, I am back from the retreat and I'm here for all of you to be also for those of you who purchased a reading last week from Thursday to Sunday I will deliver the readings today by the end of the day so thank you thank you and thank you again Leo's the energy what comes today are what I do deliver also for some of you you might experience this situation I'm talking about for some of you you will or you are right now so take it accordingly since it's a general read let's see here loves what we got for you whatever message comes comes i will say it let's see here what we got for you here it comes happiness also what i'm feeling here i see a relief I don't know what kind of relief, but I see you just like now the sun comes to my door. For some of you, you might say that or you feel that comes. For some of you, you might deal with a twin energy as right now and you might reunite with that person. Absolutely. It is a reunion between you and your twin. For some of you, it is coming. And for some of you, you really waited for a long time. But definitely, I see a celebration. And it's coming on the next holiday. What I'm hearing from Spirit, which is in here where I am, is the Thanksgiving holiday. So, could be happen right now or will happen in a few. Let's see here what we got, loves. All right, Leo, for what you sacrifice is so much. And now I feel here you say, I don't want this anymore. You've been dealing with a situation which drained you emotionally here. Could be with a Sag, could be with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, with, or with an earth sign. I see a Sag again. Yeah. And Capricorn could be a fire sign, earth sign, but I feel here you really Leo really need to stand up for what you truly believe. For some of you, you have a new job opportunity. I will say, don't say no right away because you tend to say no right away. I will say, hang out, hang a little bit out there. I will say to talk about it because I see some delays in that, also some delays of finances. And be aware of that. For some of you, you you might be dealing with a situation where you hanging over there for quite a bit and now you know what you really need to know your worth. Because I feel here, for some of you, you are done and over. The other person is to tell you, honestly, Leo, they are very conflicted. They kind of not accept a no here for an answer. Also, we have this three major arcana here, also with the hangman, the fourth major arcana in your reading. It tells me here this situation, it involves a past life connection, most likely a karmic situation comes around to you. And is a lesson for you to learn, loves. Even it's making you very confused. It's making you, I don't know how to move forward. Spirit says, take one day at a time, take it slow, controlled. For some of you, yes, you are open to communication. For some of you, you just say, I don't need this anymore. But for some of you, I definitely see here, the communication is about emotions. For some of you, emotions, relationship, for some of you, is finances from somebody who you've been tied on. Yes, I definitely see here 
you say no to somebody here, this person is not okay with that. They really want to come back. Also, what I'm feeling here, this person is not letting you go so easy. But for you, learning to say no, it is a relief. I see again this Ten of Cups. It is a relief for you to learn that no is a good word for you to say, especially to this person. Okay? For many of you, I don't feel this person very honest. Even they appear to be that honest. Even they appear to give you something. I don't feel they are genuine with their energies. If they want to talk and you don't, keep your sight that way. That's what the Spirit says. Because this person is all about conflict. Okay? With the magician and devil, they might appear very balanced. They might appear very, like, surrender. I want to make peace with you. But you know they're manipulative. They are very, very manipulative. That's why you you might be very concerned what this is about. But also, Leos, you do know with this hangman, you do know what this person is about. Let's see here why why you it's kind of what I'm feeling here. You protect your feelings. You protect yourself from this person. It's kind of you've been through a lot of battle with them. And now as they appear to be honest to you, they want to give you something. They really tell you, I'm, I'm honest to you. I want to offer you this new beginning. I want something new to start between us. It's hard for you to believe that they change because... Yes, they do appear here. They healed. They got, you know, things together. For some of you, you might feel like they got their shit together to say that. But absolutely, I don't see that. I don't see that. Why this two of swords? Why, why are you protecting here? Six of swords. For some of you, you try to move forward from them. Because it was not a give and take. Yes, for some of you, you've been distance between you two, but you know this person is not balanced and they created unbalance around you. Why they want to talk about, why they still fighting here to, to get your attention. Because I feel here, for some of you, yes, you deal with somebody who seeks attention. And they still want to talk. They still want to get... like It's kind of like they miss your attention. It's like you don't really react. But I feel here it is a betrayal from the past. What they want to talk about here. Why they are fighting for here. Wheel of Fortune. Sag energy again. They could be a Sag with air or earth in the chart. Yes, you might be married with them. They they don't really feel nurture the way they've been next to you. They if you sat down and over and you moved on from them and you try to take care of you, get yourself together, this person really wants back to you. They want the commitment you gave them. They want something new here. They might put the kids in the place that, look, let's do this, let's do that because of them. But that is not because of the kids. It's because they want that. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sag, here, Air, Sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But I definitely see here could be a strong Sag energy with Earth in the chart or an Earth sign with Fire, Sag in the chart. I feel here this person really wants you back here. 
but I feel you you need to take in count how you are now, how you've been before with them, how this relationship developed. This person might might be that commitment phobe person, like they cannot leave if they are not in a commitment. And if you say no to them and you try to move forward and you feel they are not in balance, they might appear now as balance, but I don't see them. They are not balanced yet. For some of you, you, you might block them in the past. They come back to communicate with you, which that is a little confusion to you. For some of you, you, you consider it for the kids or for their connection you have, but you try to take it slow to see where it goes. Either way, I don't feel you give them too many chances or another chance, but I definitely see them. They, they want back in a commitment with you. For many of you, Leos, I feel here you are way happier right now. For some of you, it's coming somebody new into your life. You consider it, but you are not, you feel I'm not really ready for relationship. I'm happy to see it, but I'm not really ready because you still have a lot of things to process from another relationship. Yeah. So Leo's, this is what I got for you for this dailies. I hope resonate for some of you this storyline and thank you for watching and being here on the channel. Much, much appreciation and we'll see you tomorrow. Namaste.